Hey guys, what is going on? It's Hamish and I'm really happy to announce that I've just figured out how to do something that I've been trying to do for two hours. So let's just get into it. Today's video, I'm going to show you how to add a background image on your footer in Dawn, Shopify, etc, etc. So as you can see right now, this is just uh, what is known as accent. Um, so what you want to do is you want to go to uh, your code. So edit code. This took me ages and ages and ages to work out, but I finally did it. You want to, uh, let me just make this full screen actually. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to go to section footer. So you can just type in section dot footer, or not dot, sorry, uh, hyphen footer. I'm going to open this up. And then at the very top where it says dot footer, and you won't believe what I was just doing for two hours, I was putting it here because I I just saw the word background, so I went for it. And all you want to do is you want to copy this code. I'll leave it in the description. And the URL here is we're going to add an asset now. And all you need to do is choose your background image. So um, I need a random thing. Okay, so this is going to tell me that I've already got the, this file uploaded, but whatever. Okay, so once you have uploaded your uh, asset, you'll be able to see it. So look, it's here, wildwest1.png. So all we're going to do now is change this, where it says paper.gif, to wildwest1.png. So background image, URL, wildwest.png. Uh, and then I'm going to just add um, this. I don't know if that will work. I don't know if that's quite the correct code, so I'll have to check that in a second. But let's go on funkypigs.store. And as you can see now, here is my background. Obviously, this is a terrible example of a background, but it looks really nice and it slides really, really nicely. And yeah, that's it. You can put any image you want. You can make it look really, really nice, and I'm actually going to do this on one of my Shopify stores. Uh, yeah, I hope this helps you out, guys. This took me a while to learn, so leave a like if it did help you out, and I'll see you tomorrow or maybe even later today with another tutorial. Peace out. Okay, just to add to this, I'll leave this in the, uh, the article, but uh, background repeat, no repeat. And as long as you have a properly sized image, it will not repeat, and it will look perfect. I don't know what the dimensions are, the recommended dimensions. You'll have to look yourself. Let's just see how this looks on mobile. I would actually suggest using a, oh, yeah. I would suggest using a repeat image because uh, on mobile it's not going to look great. So let's remove this and it should look a little bit better, obviously depending on your uh, store. My store does not look very good generally. But yeah, you, you get the idea. Just use a small repeated image and it should look nice. Uh, peace out.